Kit Doe, we're live here at the Powell Street BART station in San Francisco where there was a bloody crime scene last night. It's been cleaned up now and been disinfected, but a much different situation last night. Take a look. It appears as though the uh, victim collapsed somewhere near the pay station around 8.30 p.m. BART, uh, BART police say it did not happen inside the station, but rather the victim was attacked somewhere else at street level, escaped down the stairs, and then made their way towards the entrance. The condition of that victim is unknown. BART did not stop train service and, in fact, did not even shut down the Powell Street station at all. They just cordoned off the bloody scene and evening commuters stepped around it on their way to the train. San Francisco police now investigating what led up to that stabbing. You may remember back in September, BART safety was making headlines in the wake of the fatal stabbing of Nia Wilson. BART's board of directors introduced a five-year safety plan, parts of which included installing emergency call boxes on platforms, expanding the system's network of digital cameras, and potentially adding 90 more police officers, some of whom would exclusively staff those trains. But back here live at the Powell Street station in San Francisco where it is business as usual back to normal. We're live in San Francisco, Kitto, KPIX5.